testing, testing microphone. Hello, people, can you hear me? No, we can't see me yet, but one step at a time. One step at a time. How are we doing? Can you hear me? Wait for chat to catch up. In fact, let me just zoom in. Hiya! Can you hear me? Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Oh, it's quiet. Okay. This guy. Yeah, okay, we're getting there. Ready, ready? Hear me roar. Okay, I think that'll do it. How are we doing? We're feeling better? Is this sounding better? I know I'm quiet. That was, that was, that thing's fault. This thing. Okay, I'm not going to even show you because I don't want to break it. How are we doing? Is this better? Too loud? Or is that good? Is it good? Is it good? Are we ready to party? Oh, man. Oh, this is crazy. We're going to do some mixed reality. Oh, my God. Do you see how I have... See how useful, like... <laughs> it might have looked a bit redundant or silly to people for us to get this TV for the studio, but it's so useful. for Especially when I have to take my headset off and check something. It's, like, right there. So, yeah, it'll be good. Especially when I do, like, some future DSLR filming and stuff, I can use that as a monitor so I can keep stuff distant but still have a good view. It's great. Okay. Uh, too quiet, people say. Is this okay or is it good? Quiet. Let me just check. Let me, let me just check. Okay. Uh, I think that's okay, to be honest. Uh, I think if I went too much louder than that, when I scream, which I'm bound to do, it'll peak. So, uh, yeah, let me just, let me just double check levels. I'm going to bring that down and this up. 90 okay set that as the default and we're good now i don't want to take too long um getting ready but i do have to get ready so let's just test things out Ooh, what's gone missing one of the controls mixed reality doesn't work unless both controllers and the tracker is detected but as you can see when they are detected i'm in virtual reality <laughs> oh boy this is exciting, guys. Aren't you excited? I am. <laughs> okay, okay. What am I going to do? What am I? What do I need to get ready? Because I don't want to take too long, but I do have to get ready. The main thing I need to get ready is my um, VR overlay, so I can see you guys with my headset on. So I'm going to need you to be patient with me while I set this up. It'll take me maybe ten minutes. But it's very important, and it means it will mean I can watch the Twitch chat while I am in VR, and it means I can see this camera, the mixed reality view, when I'm in VR. So let me just pop Hi, this out. This camera, uh, when I'm in VR. Quiet, you. Pop out. Where are you? How do I? How, oh, for God's sake! How do I make the chat? <laughs> Pop out. Pop out. There we go. Okay. Pop out. So I have a Twitch chat pop out. That's what I need. I'm just going to make this bigger. And make that bigger. Okay. Okay. They're the two screens I really need to see. So I'm going to set those up. Just let the thingies detect me. All right. So... VR overlay, select this thing, and then I'm going to add OBS. Thank you for your patience with this, guys. OBS, so much technical stuff. It's crazy. All right, boom. There's OBS. Let me just move it. Oh, not that way. Go that way. There we go. There we go. That's pretty perfect. I know you can't see it, but I can. All right, cool, 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 cool. All right, that gives me a pretty good view of what's going on. And then I need one more, which is Twitch. Okay, Twitch. Oh, wait, what's going on? Twitch, Google Chrome. 
Can I only do one at a time? Hmm. Don't know what that's about. Oh, okay, so I don't know what, why that's not working. Come back. Let's try that again. If I can't get it working in a timely manner, I will have to give up pretty quick so I can get stuff done because we have a pretty short stream today. Yeah, I can't, I can't get it working. I have Twitch chat on this monitor, so I'm going to have to peek every now and then and chat with you guys then. Uh, the problem is, I'm going to have to, uh, if, there are, if there are like major problems, like if the audio cuts, I'm not going to know, which is, a, which is a real problem, but yeah, I hope you have air conditioner. Um, <laughs> heating, actually, it's freezing cold here. Let's uh, get this tested. All right, ready? Boom. Hello, mixed reality. Look at me, I am in another world. Ooh, whoops. Yay, see, look. Oh, hey, and that's what the office looks like. This is like a portal to another dimension. Come this way into my portal. Oh, there's the portal again. Isn't that trippy? <laughs> Isn't that trippy that like you lean this way and it's like, oh, it's the world beyond the portal. Anyway, all right. What's our, uh, the color's looking all right. I think, I think, I think we're looking good. Okay. A whole new world. A new fantastic point of view. No one to tell us no. Or where to go. Or say we're only dreaming. A whole new world. A dazzling place I never knew. I'll see how much I want, Probat23. Screw you and you... Screw you! <laughs> All right, I'm going to put these on. Oh, this is funky. I, I've never used this before. This is my green jelly container. I feel like I'm delaying, which I don't want to do, because, again, I have a short stream. But uh, I do want to get this going. I should, pr should probably have wait. I should probably have done this beforehand, as part of the preparation thing. You know, when I was supposed to be prepared. Nope. Skipped that step. Looks like wibbly nothing. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's right, because you can't see. Oh boy. All right. This is what it looks like. I totally forgot that it was already being chroma keyed out. <laughs> there you go. I'm just trying to fit this on. I mean, it's, it's a good sign that you couldn't see it, I guess. Okay, that seems to seems to be wrapped around it pretty good. Whoop. Shouldn't have done that. And how does that look? Hello. That's pretty trippy. It's pretty, especially when I have it in front of me. It's sort of distracting. I'm going to take it off. <laughs> I think for this kind of game, it's not a good thing. <laughs> All right. We've had enough distractions. It's time to get stuck into it. Into the mixed reality. Oh, yeah. Virtual, virtual reality. Mm hmm. <laughs> All right, now, uh, I do need to tweak my lights. Don't want to be too glary. How am I looking? I'm looking good. Isn't this tri trippy? <laughs> oh, I love this. I love it. All right, so, too much lag. Volume quiet. Volume is low. How's the volume low? Oh, for God's sake. I can't... I if you can hear it, you're going to have to just deal with it. Like, that'll have to do. Let me just test it so that... I can't. Yeah, no, sorry. That's, that's good. 
That's good. I can't have it too loud because it'll start peaking and be hard to edit in post. Um, volume is fine. Is lag an issue or is that just one person who was like it was laggy? Because I might have to ignore them. Sorry. <laughs> no lag. All right. Well, do you know what? It's time to do this because I do have a limited time. We have two hours. I have an alarm set for when I have to cut it cold and stop. So uh, this is like a timed challenge. Um, so I'm streaming, I'm recording on both computers. I think I'm ready to start. <coughs> the problem is, what is, what is the problem? The problem is I need to start off my thing dramatically like this. I need to talk directly to the... There you go, I, I have to do like an opening thing. Because I'm going to do a Game of Thrones piece today. If you couldn't tell by my graphite throne shirt, hashtag shameless plug. All right, lag is one person, says one other person. <laughs> uh, look, I'll put the volume up a little bit. There's really not much I can do, honestly. There's really not much I can do. <sighs> and I should probably prioritize starting. So I'm just going to tweak this, bring it up a little bit. Okay, okay, all right. Let's do this. <laughs> I don't, I have, I have, I have no plan. I was going to do some sort of dramatic intro, but I don't know what to say. What should I say? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to welcome back, welcome back to Mixed Reality. Today, we're going to play the Game of Thrones. And um, where do you play the... Th oh. oh, wait, no, I could say... I could, oh, I don't know. Shut up! Shut up, Red Pillow 7. <laughs> Alright. Oh, boy, it's cold. Hmm. <sighs> Let me think. Winter is coming. You wouldn't know it because we're in the middle of a desert. But I promise you it's coming. No wonder people think... No wonder people think that they're crazy. All the people who are like, winter is coming. Winter is already here! Okay. Fuck. We gotta, we gotta get started. What's the time? 9.40. I suppose it's good that people are arriving. <laughs> Alright, hang on. I gotta do a dramatic opener. <clears throat> Winter is coming. But... <laughs> Winter is coming, but what? Winter is coming, but... But... Game of Thrones is already here. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Win winter is winter is coming, but um, but mixed reality is already here. <laughs> okay, yeah, man, I r roll with the cringe. That's how I. That's how I roll. Winter is coming, but mixed reality is already here. <laughs> Wait, virtual reality. I'll do virtual reality. Okay, you ready? <coughs> Winter is coming, but virtual reality is already here. <laughs> God damn it. All right, let's get started. G'day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza, and I am here in mixed reality using the Live Cube. This thing is amazing, and today I'm going to be... Mm. G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza, I'm Jazza, and today I'm here in virtual reality thanks to the LiveCube. If you want to know more about this system, I plan on doing a review sometime in the next month or two. Uh, in the meantime, I'll put a link in the description to go check them out, but today, to celebrate Game of Thrones, which has just come back, which I am very excited about, if you couldn't tell, I am going to be taking the Iron Throne for myself. 
That's right, while everyone in Westeros is busy bickering over each other and white walkers and la di da, I'm gonna make my own damn throne. Just you watch. <laughs> I think that's a good enough intro. I'm gonna turn off, believe it or not, I'm gonna turn off my heater now because this is where you build up a bit of sweat. All right, so how are we how are we doing? I'm just checking on things a little bit. I just want to see one more time if I can add my Twitch overlay. Twitch refresh. Okay. It's not working. Um yeah, no, it's not working. All right, unfortunately, I will be without Twitch chat. Uh, I will try and take my headset off every every now and then. And when I do, I need you guys to say panic, push the panic button nonstop until I notice. All right. Bum, bum, ba -da bum, bum, ba -da bum, bum, ba -da bum, 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 bum. Here we are. Virtual reality. Oh, man. I'm excited. Okay. So those of you who watched my mixed reality video creating... Ugh. So those of you who watched the um, my first... So, wait, hang on. Oh, my God. What happened? I was holding the wrong thing. That's the problem with virtual reality is you can't see what you're doing. <sighs> Pull that down. Put this on your hand. Tighten the strap. Safety first. This, I feel like I feel like wearing these VR headsets just as a as like sunglasses on your forehead is like a cool fashion statement. Okay. So for those of you who watched my virtual reality, so for those of you who saw, so those of you who saw, <laughs> sorry guys, so those of you who saw my first ever mixed reality video last week will remember this environment. This is a program called Google Blocks. Right, so a lot of you who have seen my VR videos know I'm very familiar with Tilt Brush. Today we're going to spend pretty much most of our time in blocks building the Iron Throne. Now I'm going to go through. The Let me close this off. Now I'm going to go through the tutorial one more time. So I'm going to go through the tutorial again, so you can join me in learning how this program works. Would you like a tutorial? Sure. Oh no. It launched in the wrong direction. How do I close it? Exit the tutorial. What if I aim in this direction? Ah, oh, there we go. That works. Okay, let's learn the basics. Actually, let's let's launch that again. I'm going to move the camera this way. Face it out here. All right. Okay, I would like a tutorial. How about a quick tutorial? Sure. Let's learn the basics. Okay. Who doesn't like ice cream? <laughs> well, I do. Move it closer to you with the grip button. Boom. <gasps> Boom. How about another scoop? Okay, so you switch shapes with these arrows across here. So you can see that on the controller, they show up as different shapes above the controller. So I've got a circle, you click, place it, now for the cherry on top. That's too big, size it down. So you press this button here, makes it smaller or bigger. Smaller, there we go. Place the cherry on top, beep. Now paint it red. When you flip this over, oh, so you select your paintbrush, flip this over, select your red color, like that, and go floop. There you go. Your friend wants one. Let's make a copy. Choose the grab tool. Grab it like that. Oh. And now click this to copy. There you go. Look at this. I got another ice cream. Place it next to the original. 
Your friend doesn't want a cherry. Grab the eraser. Boom. Boom. Erase. There you go. My friend doesn't want a cherry. Spoiled bastard. Okay. All right. Well, that's the tutorial. Um, so that's that's the basics of how it works. You can flip through different block types, and I'm sure there are there are some more refined things. So today we're going to explore what we can make. Where's the camera? There's the camera. Therefore, the <laughs> I'm actually doing this blind. I should look so I don't break things. Okay. Okay. How are we doing? Don't press the panic button unless... Unless it's actually a panic. Don't, don't you dare freak me out because I only check intermittently. So, you're a liar. You're a big fat liar. Poo head. It's not a panic at all. Okay. So, we're going to build the Iron Throne, which, as you know, is made of a whole bunch of swords. So, we're going to see if we can make a sword. What's inserts? So these are our tools. We have the shape thing. There's something called insert stroke, which I believe it's like drawing. There you go. Interesting. We can undo that. And you can change your stroke type. That's interesting. So in theory, if I do this, click, oops, if I do that, Can I mod it? Can I grab it like this? <gasps> there you go. Oh, oh, look at that. And can I pinch this out? I can. <gasps> See, I think this is how I'm going to make a sword is pinching out bits of this shape. Oops. Pinch it out. That looks swordish. Let's grab it. Okay, so we've got a, we're starting to get a sword shape. Whoosh, whoosh. <laughs> this is cool. <gasps> okay, I'll stop. I'm sorry. All right, let's, let's uh, add a tip to the sword blade. Let's pinch this end out like this. Can I uh, be more refined? All right, we can do that. And uh, maybe let's bring these together. Oh, they like, they lock together. That's interesting. And I ruined the mesh. Hmm. How's chat going? All right. We've made some progress, but this is not, this is not what I want. Let's start again. Let's start with a shape. What shape is going to turn into a sword? I think a square makes the most sense. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm going to create a square like this. I'm going to pinch it. Let's, let's just stretch it out a little bit. Let's just stretch it out a little bit like that. I can make it thinner. thing is I want the pointy bit, so I don't know actually how to do that. What if I do it the opposite way? What if I... What if I bring this end in? The problem is we need to be able to subdivide. I don't know if it lets you do that. Crap. Hmm. Reshape. There's a button here. There's a button here that's reshape. That's uh, potentially what I want. Subdivide. Subdivide. There's a subdivide button. Okay. Subdivide. Let's subdivide the top. <gasps> Did it work? Great. 
sort of. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, we're getting there. I'm gonna start with a new shape. One step at a time. One step at a time. We're learning. Okay. Okay. You guys can come in here with me. Get in nice and close. I'm just gonna uh, lift this up. Oh boy. Okay. Just watch. All right. Okay, third time's the charm. Click. Modify. Extrude. That's what, there's an extrude button. That's what we want. Okay, because what we're going to do is bring all this together. It'll lock together up the top. It's kind of fancy. There you go. So we've got a point. We've got a point. Then I'm going to extrude the bottom like this. Ooh. Wait, it sort of worked, but not really. There you go. Okay, so I've extruded the bottom. Now I can pinch the sides, bring them in. <gasps> oh, it's worked. It's worked. Except it's, uh, you know, incredibly asymmetrical. So let's let's be nice and refined with this. There's a grid mode. In the grid mode, you can see these dots. I don't know if it locks to the dots. It sort of does. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right, fourth time's the charm. I'm gonna start again, do the whole thing in grid mode. Square, boom, modify, bring these together. Oh, bugger off. Boom, boom, boom. All right, that's looking better. Let's bring this in, bring this in. Okay. Extrude the bottom. See, it's so much easier when it keeps it symmetrical for you. Okay. Okay, I have the basic of a sword blade. need to make sure it's nice and symmetrical. <sighs> How are we doing? We're doing okay. Just making sure. All right, so because the throne is built up of so many swords, first of all, let's pick a color that we like. Let's go to a nice steel gray. Okay, basically, I'm gonna need copies of this because I'm gonna need make. Basically, I'm gonna need copies of this because I'm gonna want multiple types of uh, swords. So I'm just gonna 